ayo rangi ayo nuku ayo moana ayo tangata te rato ku wai ayo he kare kare kore tawana ko te marino ko tau ponu ia tia te karo he nei a ti hei mauri ora e te fano o nga ti tu fare to ano mai ki mai a ki te ho taka nei o tu a kiri tanga a ko eza te nei to ko te kai fuka pao now um it's been a bit of a while since we caught up with the brother my guest today Mr Nofolaveko chema bro <laughs> kia ora kia ora kia ora kia ora chema bro <laughs> kia ora everybody how's it oh. going my bro, it's been a while since we've caught up, and um, yeah, a lot has happened, eh? A lot has happened like, since we last caught up. Bro, since we last caught up, we've had a pandemic. <laughs> so, <laughs> so that's how long. Yeah, don't even get me started. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bro, um, just just very very quickly, if you could introduce yourself to the Fano. Um, like maybe where you where you were brought up and and just you know all those bits and pieces for our whānau who yes. might have known you. Talofa, talofa, tukui ngā kona koala la meko, au se tamaliki tu valu, and I'm from a little place called Tennis Creek Kōrirua. Um, I am currently living in Auckland at the moment, and I am and I'm here for represent, representing Foundation. Kia ora. Um, Kia ora. <laughs> mame, mame. Um, oh, man. so you one of those ones in Auckland, bro? Yeah, bro. <laughs> we've, been, we've, been on, we've been on level three for, I can't even remember how long. Uh, it must feel like a lifetime, eh, my man? Yeah, man, it's been, it's been, it's been tough. It's been tough this, this, this lockdown, especially. Yeah. Uh, best, best to still have, uh, have money. But, but yeah, we're, we're, we're still, we're still pushing through. No, nice, bro. <laughs> It's just that, that typical uh, Kiwi um, Kiwi blood, eh, bro, that runs through us for that Kiwi yeah. drive. Yeah. Right? yeah, still got to keep going. We still got to make money, <laughs> eh, bro? <laughs> 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 oh, well, mate, um, obviously, uh, I mean, let, let's be honest, um, music in COVID over the last year and a half or so have, have a very love-hate relationship Mm. Um, at one stage there, we were awesome and we were the only country having huge ass concerts. LAB was selling out and everyone was was in there. From from the music perspective for you, my bro, how, how tough has it been? Um, personally, personally, this, this lockdown has been, has been uh, good and bad. Mm. Um, the positive, the positive has, has been, um, I've been learning a lot, I've been doing heaps of um, homework on on how this industry works, the business side of things. Um, so I've learned I've learned a lot about that and that's that's a good thing. Um, but the negative things is like especially for this lockdown I've got a few plans for our foundation crew um, with video shoots and stuff and we can't really uh, move to do that at the moment because apparently we can only do 10, 10 people. But um yeah so that 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 kind of like heavy depression, you know, like. But but um, I, I jumped into the studio last night and I uh, kind of let it all out. It's, it's good music, music, music has 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 been good. But but um, playing wise, I know I know I'm not the only one struggling as well. I know a few a few musicians out here are, are really struggling with the choice of of getting the vaccine as well and and everything that that that's ahead of us, I guess. But yeah, I was there one love this year when when Joel was saying we're lucky to be the only ones playing. But um I'm hoping I'm hoping that you won't be on in this lockdown for long. But yeah, much love to all my musicians out, out there. Uh, um, keep writing. <laughs> it's <something> to write. <laughs> I, I guess that that's really much the the, the the only positive um, to the lockdown is that for, yeah, for creatives, and I think across all, all spectrums of creatives, uh, yeah. it's actually been awesome to be in lockdown and just create. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, bro. That's, that's the positive thing about about the, the lockdown is you have the time to, to create, right? Paint, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, <laughs> let, let's get on to some positive stuff, my bro. Now, um, yep. the, the boys, uh, or the band foundation. Ooh. Man. Ooh. Bro. Oh. 
I must admit, when I when I first heard that um, that you had taken over the lead vocals duties, I was yeah. like, "Oh, that's just gangster." Yeah. Um, well, I've been I've been with I've been with the band for about two years. Uh, yeah. It's this lockdown, I've decided to take on the manager hat as well. So that's been exciting. Um, we've got heaps. I've got I've got heaps planned for the boys. Uh, we've got three singles coming out this this month, uh, this summer. Yeah. So we've got one. we got one coming out. Oh, uh, it's out. <laughs> it's out. <laughs> go go get it. Spotify, iTunes. Um, but yeah, we've got we've got another single coming out next month. And hopefully, if this COVID all works out and my plan stays in plan, we'll have another another one coming out on uh, in January. Yeah. But. Uh, but we're pumping. Our, our, our album is looking fire right now. Yeah. Um, Nizi, Nizi is fire at the moment. Uh, we've got uh, the whole band is on board. Uh, Sienna is back in the band. Uh, Jamie, with, with his writing skills, we're just smashing. We're just smashing songs through. Yeah. But um, yeah, album definitely coming out next year. So I'm, I'm excited to uh, to release the album. Yeah. I've just been joking around with the boys. It's like. This album's gonna be better than the first album. <laughs> like, you know, compete, compete with yourself. You know, like foundation versus foundation. So, yeah. so it's been, um, it's, it's, it's been, it's been fun. It's very exciting. It's very awesome. exciting for, for, for the band. Awesome. But yeah, we can't wait. Now, we can't, man, wait, I to can't wait. Release either. all of these songs. <laughs> um, if, if, if just correct me if I'm wrong, but oh why? Which was the song that was released uh, what a few months ago? Last back year. Now? Last yeah, year? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Has it been last year? Yeah, bro. So that was my first first project with the boys. That was it, eh? Yeah. I was just about to ask yeah. you that. Yeah, that was your first yeah, album yeah. with them. Yeah, yeah, that was my first that was that was definitely my first single for the boys. And we got mixed mixed um mixed mixed uh feedback about yeah. a new vocalist for, for foundation. So it was that's okay. It's it was, it's, it's expected. It's, just, yeah. it's expected for, for for me to get some 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 backlash or not really backlash, but yeah, yeah, some feedback like that. Yeah, but yeah, yeah it was people's good. people's own views, eh? Their, their perspective. Yeah, 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 yeah. But these but these next songs will definitely change their mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You mentioned, um, you know, let's be honest. He he is a legend in the music industry and, and the bro doesn't get enough props but um yeah. what's it like working with Nizi my bro to be honest coming coming from the island I came I came to New Zealand when I was nine so I've just met all these musicians and all of these like even even like the American history of music I didn't even know until my 20s mm. so like meeting Nizi have to I didn't really know what he's done I've just learned along the way Wow! It's like, whoa! Oh my! You did this! You did this! You did this! You did this! It's like, it's 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 amazing. There was there's actually a, a one time when I was recording last year with with Nizi, and I was live on Facebook and, and Tiffany from the Bay, mm. Tiffany like like messages me like, but how did you end up in the studio with Nizi, bro? <laughs> and I was like, bro, come over, and he came over. So, <laughs> I, I, I really I, I really didn't know what I was getting into, but the man's a genius. Um, he's, he's the man and I've trusted him I, I trust him in the studio mm. like whatever he tells me so I just, I just listen and learn yeah 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 man he's, he's a good one we've, we've also got a, another producer that's been helping out uh, with, um, with production with Nizi uh, his name's Travis he comes from the Hooks Bay as well mm. uh, uh, yeah yeah he's, he's, he's amazing too so yeah. we we'll, we're actually looking forward to jumping on the road and and, and hopefully COVID stays away and we will be in, in your area soon. Yeah, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Let's jump to today, bro. Uh, your guys' brand new single's out. It's called, well, Slow, Start Love Over. Um, yeah, yeah. Bro. Start, Start Love Over is actually a, a, a cover. Uh, this, is, this is our first summer single, so we thought we would, we would release a cover. And it's from Miles J. Um, we just chucked the foundation spin on it. Yeah. Bro, it, 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 it's a whole new song, but... <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, oh, man. This is what I love about summer and I, and what I love about our, 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 
our Aotearoa bands is that they start dropping these fire tracks mm. and these gems, mm. right? Man, summer is definitely the time um, yeah. to get those to get those new tracks, and everyone yeah, seems yeah, to yeah. be dropping them. But I think, in a sense, you guys always come under the radar. And there's yeah. this song that you do, and I think this one is definitely going to be one for the summer, my mate. Definitely. Oh man, if you think this one's going to be for the summer, you wait until our next month's release. <laughs> oh, bro. Oh, bro. Oh, bro. Oh, bro man. Man. I'm just saying, though, our January and next month's release is probably going to contest with every, everybody's summer day. Ooh, so, it's, it's, always, it's, it's always been under the radar because. You know, there's, there's these things like marketing and, and, and you know, all of these yeah. Yeah. things that I had to learn. And I just learned them in the last the last couple of couple of months. And I've got a whole team behind us this time. So, so you, you guys will definitely see, it, see a lot more foundation in the next couple of months. Yeah. In the summer anyway. But yeah. 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 Can't wait, my friend. Um, but besides, besides the music, bro, and if, if COVID plays the game, what are you up to for, for summer, bro? What are you up for Christmas? Uh, we have, we have, uh, Foundation has three shows at the moment booked in for, for summer. We're coming down to Tamaranui. Yeah. Um, uh, in Feb. And, and then we've got, we've got summer frequencies in Gisborne in January the 7th and 8th. Um, and then we have a little, Christmas get together up here before Christmas nice. up here in Auckland. Nice, but but that's a, a COVID state yeah. right away from us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, right, yeah, bro. We're very we're very excited. Our whole our whole unit, our whole foundation crew. We're very excited to to release these this next uh, journey. I guess mm. this next part of our journey. Mm. Right, yeah. Well, my bro, it's it's awesome to be a part of that journey um, as as Two Forty Four FM. Um, and yeah, let's go. Bro, give, give our love to all to all the family, to the brothers as well, and to the you know to the the beast that is Foundation. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and uh, and hope to catch up, bro, on the road, especially when you brothers come out. Uh, hard up, hard up, bro. Hard up, bro. Uh, big shout out to Two Forty Four FM. Big love from our FM. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> love me.